Lent is a powerful season that calls us to go beyond the everyday. Hello, I'm Father Leo Paddlinghug, host of GraceBeforeMeals.com, and this is CRS Rice Bowl's Global Kitchen. Throughout Lent, we tried out a series of simple, meatless recipes and encouraged you to take the money you save by not purchasing meat and other items during Lent and put that money in the CRS Rice Bowl. As a priest, I appreciate CRS Rice Bowl for the way it connects food with culture and turns sacrifice into real solutions that help people in need. Remember, Lent is a season of sacrifice and reflection, and you can continue your Lenten journey by visiting crsricebowl.org. For our final Global Kitchen recipe, we will be cooking fried plantains with beans from the Democratic Republic of Congo, where most people make their living as farmers. And CRS programs make sure people can grow enough to feed their families. Fried plantains are a traditional treat in many parts of the world and a favorite in the Democratic Republic of Congo. While I haven't tried out this recipe before, fried plantains are always delicious. So if you've never had them, fair warning, you're about to be hooked. The first part of this recipe is frying the plantains. Start by peeling the plantains and cutting them into thin slices. Lightly salt both sides. Pour about six tablespoons of fair trade olive oil into a pan and heat it. Then carefully place each plantain slice into oil and fry each side until golden. Drain on a rack or paper towel. Next, we'll cook the beans. Take one large onion finely chopped and saute it in two tablespoons of olive oil. Then add two 16 ounce cans of drained black beans and one large chopped red tomato. Add paprika and chili pepper to taste. Cook this over low heat until hot. Then it's time to serve with the plantains. And before we try this together, remember a blessing for this food. The people of the Democratic Republic of Congo, you who are watching this video, and your generosity to the rice bowl. Can't wait to give this a try. It's almost like a Congo version of chip and dip. Mmm, really, really delicious. I hope you've enjoyed the Global Kitchen Meals as much as I've enjoyed cooking them with you, and I hope you're now inspired about your power to change lives during Lent. It's truly been a pleasure trying out these simple, delicious recipes with you. And until we meet again, I'm Father Leo, and this is the CRS Rice Bowl's Global Kitchen, reminding you that what you give up for Lent changes lives. Mm -hmm.